So welcome back guys. Now we are going to see how the git diff will work. Okay. So let's see how the git, uh, git diff command works in the real time scenarios. Let's say for example, let's consider a very simple example. Right now, if we are putting git diff here, okay, nothing is coming up. Now, let's make some changes, okay? Because if I am doing git status, you will see all the files are in the staging area. Let's say file 1 is in the staging area. Let's say I want to, file 1 is in the staging area. I make some changes. Let's say hello world in file 1. Okay, I'm putting this text here. In file 2 also, let me just put hello world in file 1 or file 2. Save it. In index also, let's put a content like hello world or new change in index file. Okay, I'm making some changes in the file. Now, if I do a git diff now, you will see some of the changes coming up. Now, what does this git diff is doing? Get this git diff is basically giving you the difference in the files which are there in your working directory versus or the changes which you made in the working directory to the changes which were there in your staging area. For example, let's say in the file 1, I just put this content. This content was added up in the file 1. File 2, hello world in file 2 was added up. In index, Okay, we just added, okay, so in index.html, we can see these are the existing file and this was the last content which was added up there. So yes, we are able to see all. Okay, so now, okay, now git status will give you the file modification, whereas git dev will give you the, uh, the difference between the files which are there in the staging area versus your difference in the file which are there in your working directory. Now let's say I will add it. Okay. Now all the files are there in the staging area. If you are doing git status, all the files you will see are in the staging area. Now what you will do? Git diff staged. So basically this git diff stage command would be giving you the difference between your local repository versus your staging area. Let's check it out. So these are the changes you can see. Okay, so from my local repository, the last repository, the local repository and this, these are the changes which is being there. And all these things we are able to check with the help of git diff hyphen hyphen stage. So yes, to check the, com to compare the files content between staging as well as between the local repository, we would be using git diff hyphen hyphen stage to compare the, uh, to, to compare the content, the difference in the content in the file which are there in your staging area versus to your working directory would be done with the help of git diff. Okay, so that's all in the dev guys. Thank you.